Many are concerned about a wave of evictions in the fall as the state of Oregon struggles to distribute rental assistance to those who need it. We have been asking for weeks how many people have actually been paid. Today, our Lindsay Nadrich finally got some answers. So far, the state says they paid less than 2% of tenants who have applied for help through the Oregon Emergency Rental Assistance Program, which means they have a lot of work left to do and not a lot of time to do it before rental protections expire. The most urgent challenge we face right now is continuing to get emergency resources into the hands of tenants struggling to pay rent. More than 17,500 households have applied for rental assistance, but so far, only 265 households have received any money. Andrea Bell, the Director of Housing Stabilization for Oregon Housing and Community Services, says another 1,100 people should be getting payments in the next 72 hours, but the state still has thousands of applications left to process. The eviction moratorium expired on June 30th, but thanks to legislation, tenants were given an extra 60 days to pay rent and avoid eviction if they can provide documentation to their landlord that they've applied for rental assistance. People in Multnomah County now have 90 days, so they're protected from eviction for non-payment through September 25th if they've applied for help. So the clock is ticking to get rental assistance out. And when I asked Belle if she thinks they'll be able to do that before rental protections expire, I didn't get a clear answer. To your question of do we think we can make that, uh, meet that 60 day time frame, our local administrators are meeting the urgency of this need. Absolutely, we do not call that into question. But what we know, what we're finding here in Oregon that is not so unique is the need for additional capacity to really get through these applications. Bell did say they're continuing to hire people to help speed up the process. It's also not too late to apply for rental assistance. We have links to do that on coin.com. In downtown Portland, I'm Lindsay Natterich, Coin 6 News.